denouncing fraud and vote rigging. The party of Pakistan's ousted Prime Minister Nawaz Sharif said it would reject the outcome of the country's general elections as preliminary results gave a considerable lead to political newcomer Imran Khan. The Pakistani masses will never bear such an unfair vote. They will do everything in their power to secure their democratic rights, politically and legally. And we will also use all available options. The campaign had been plagued for months by allegations that the country's military, which fell out with the former ruling party, had been trying to influence the vote in favor of Khan. As the results trickled in, at least four opposition parties denounced interference by armed forces at polling stations around the country, saying their agents weren't given accurate information and were in some cases forced to leave. The vote was further marred by unexpected delays in ballot counting, but the country's electoral commission insisted these were caused by technical difficulties and that the election had been 100 percent free and fair. There is no conspiracy nor any pressure in the delay of results. The delay is being caused because the result transmission system has collapsed. EU election observers said they hadn't witnessed any irregularities yet, but that they would need to wait until Friday to make a final statement. Imran Khan's supporters, meanwhile, didn't let the controversy dampen their spirits and already began celebrating their victory on Wednesday.